Oh. <laughs> oh, that's odd. I thought I was the only one with a sound mind here. I'm sure I don't need to introduce myself? Note these golden wings? Yes, you guessed it. You don't know who I am. Preposterous! Everyone in Krat has heard of me. Do you live under a rock? I'm Alidoro the Hound. Treasure hunter extraordinaire. Yes, yes, it's a nickname. I ditched my real name in the past. I'm looking for other survivors of this disaster, but it's uh, been a lonely search, and there's danger around every corner. Do you know of a place where I can take refuge? Preferably someplace clean and comfortable, you know, civilized. Vanini works. I didn't give that place much thought. That's where the puppets are being made, after all. But I heard tell of a shelter there as well. With no first-hand knowledge, I suppose I have to trust you. I have a lot of searching ahead of me, so why don't I lighten my load? Consider this an act of charity. A thank you gift. Take it. Since you're so helpful, I'll give you a peek at my collection. Show me what you're worthy of. As a descendant of aristocrats, the very best families, I have a duty to the common people. I live my life fulfilling that duty. And part of that duty is ensuring these items are returned to their rightful owners. What I'm showing you is just a portion of the collection. If you come to the refuge, we'll be able to continue our confabulation. Until then, remember this hound when golden wings shine.
Oh, thank you. Just seeing the Archbishop's holy mark renews my spirit. It's a reminder of the quiet power of faith. I'll remember this forever, Stalker. It's a reminder of the quiet... way around a weapon. Always welcome, friends. its limits. I don't even know if Geppetto is aware of this. Learn from how humans behave, how they feel. Even lie if you must. Those lies may change you, may rewrite reality. Lies are a weapon used by humans who thrive in a world of deception. I'll use my power to help you.
voyage is set. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go back to the old Krat. The old me. Before the greed overtook me. Never meet again. Can't say I'm happy to see you, though. <clears throat> Sorry, I let my frustration get the better of me. <laughs> this place is crawling with hostile puppets. You must have known that, but you still sent me here. Honor and trust are everything to this hound. You've insulted me to the core. I'll never forgive you. But perhaps there's a shred of decency in you? So I'll ask again. Do you know of a safe place? See? This is how we rebuild trust, you and I. I'll take another chance on you. I'm nothing if not magnanimous, you see. But beware. A hound's teeth are sharper than a sword. One bite is enough to take your life. You tricked me with your lie. You disappoint me. But I'm no stranger to beneficence, so I shall let it pass one more time. Know that even my forgiveness has its limits. Remember, the hound's fangs crave the traitor's neck. You tricked me with but your time. Remember.
People have no idea, thanks for keeping me company. Oh, it's you! This hotel is indeed a refuge from the dangers of the outside world. I am the Hound, a descendant of the city's most aristocratic families. Repaying debts is what we nobles do. Anyone with a worthy spirit is especially welcome. Accordingly, I shall give you the honor of laying eyes upon my treasure. However, you must prove your worthiness. For this legendary treasure, the ergo of a powerful enemy shall suffice. It's up to you if you want to make the exchange. Take your time to admire it. I've certainly done likewise. Welcome to Hotel Prat. How may I be of service? This is a supply box, officially approved by the city of Krat. I shall open it and add it to the hotel shop. Many thanks, good sir. Welcome to Hotel Prat. Seeking refuge became monsters somehow. But the petrification disease turns you to stone, not into a monster. I'm worried about the Malam district, just below the cathedral. I wonder whether there are monsters there, too. Close your eyes. Come to me. Feel alright. Just dance with me all the time. Turn it off. Close to you. I feel good. At the house of Anini, even priceless. Stalker? The Hound? I Is it true you brought him here? Well, I, I didn't know he was still alive. Thank heavens. I haven't seen him in person, and I don't know how I'd react. How do you thank the man who saved your life? <laughs> I'm so glad that someone so kind has reached safety. And speaking of safety, please take care of yourself out there. You're not the only one who's curious. Most people get around to asking where I'm from. My looks give it away, don't they? Suffice it to say, I'm from the country of the morning, beyond the ocean. <laughs> but I wouldn't be much of a tour guide. All I know about it is their weapons. My family was a house of weapon specialists. It's quite a reputation to live up to. They almost took charge of planning for the grand exhibition. 
But that's their reputation, not mine. And they deserted me when I was little. I don't even know who they are. And my reputation is my own. I suppose my only connection to them would be... weapons. So I'm an orphan, and that hardly makes me exotic and crot. Can I help you with anything else? I know my way around a weapon. Petrification disease turned into a monster. That's just tragic. Could the disease lead to puppet frenzy? Hmm. No, that doesn't make sense. Remember, puppets cannot get the disease. But puppets shouldn't frenzy either. I made them to obey and protect humans, not go berserk and harm them. But the stalkers blame me. They think I worked with the alchemists to spread the disease to puppets. <sighs> How sad. All this resentment, with a lie at the root of it. That's why my only wish is that you stay a good boy. No resentment, no lies. The city of Krat asked me and
I've been investigating the puppet frenzy and... It looks like I need your help. First, let me show you a little something I've been working on. I call it the Ergo Wavelength Decoder. Mm, the name lacks a certain flair, but I assure you it works. If my suspicions are correct, something in the puppet's very Ergo is causing their aggression. My decoder can find malicious signals within the waves, but I cannot possibly get close enough to gather the Ergo wave records myself. You, on the other hand, would you? Could you? I... I refuse to believe the King of Puppets is truly behind this... this puppet rampage. It's too simple, but also a bit too much even for him. No. I suspect the Ergo itself is corrupted, or at least compromised. I do so desperately want to find the cause, as I'm sure you do too, my friend. It breaks my heart to see puppets turned into murderous tools of bloodshed. I always welcome friends. May I be of...